How's it going there, YouTube? Well, I got another beautiful spring morning up here today. Oh, I'm gonna play around in the shed here a little bit this morning. I'll flip you guys around here. Oh, I think it's about time. I could probably put this snowblower back in the back corner and maybe have a look at that lawn more. I mean, it's a little early yet. I don't expect to be cutting the grass for about another month, but uh, I'm not expecting us to have any snow anytime soon. I only really used that snowblower about two times last winter, so I think it can go in the back corner and then I can get the snow, the lawn mower out and give it a little once over and put some fresh gas in it. And of course, I'll drain that out and put it away. And We'll go from there. I'm not, we're not expecting any snow now, so it's supposed to be double digits all this next week. Actually, next week and a half, really. So, uh, yeah, well, at least I don't have to come in here and do a big clean out like I did last year. I mean, I mean, I could organize things a little bit over here, but I haven't really done much out here since uh, the fall time because, well, didn't really have any tractors to restore. Sure, I could have done a few things at W4 last winter, but nah, when it's cold outside, who really wants to work out in a tent, carport, or whatever? I don't have any heat in there, so. Anyway, I'm going to move some stuff around here, and uh, we'll go from there. So this is what they call a reverse flow gas can. I pulled the line off the carburetor. This is the feed at the bottom of the tank. And the little end of the uh, fitting there that goes into the hose fits perfectly into the spot of the gas can. So no leak, no mess. Well, that's done. Ooh. Gee, I got quite a bit of gas out of that. That's good, you gotta save all you can in gas expensive. And I only run the premium stuff in my machines, so I'm putting that away. We got a fresh oil change I did in the fall time, and I only ran it twice, so that should be alright. But anyway, I'm using the phone today, not the tripod. Actually, the tripod is still in the machine shop from yesterday, so ah, I gotta go back so I can get the camera, but I'll just use the phone today. I'm still kind of daydreaming about picking up a. Uh newer John Deere lawn tractor here because I'm going to have to replace this lawn boy more here either this year or next year because it's uh, starting to use quite a bit of oil so I think it's 16 years old now it's brand new in 2005 so I'm going to have to replace it sooner or later but it's always been kept up on oil changes and whatnot of course but uh, you know the price of one of them new mowers I could almost buy two antique tractors for that kind of money you know I just don't think I could put out that kind of money on a tractor where I know I can get more bang for my buck and something that's antique Sure, you might not cut grass with an antique tractor without an hydraulic pump, but, you know, you collect tractors and you only got to get the most out of your money, I guess. <laughs> I should have mentioned, too, my light bar upgrade actually worked very well. I never did get that uh, power converter box like I was supposed to because I got to convert the AC power to DC power. Never did do that, but I only used it twice, so I didn't think I really heard anything. But I did realize that with the headlight... The light bar, when you're blowing snow straight forward, you get a heck of a glare off it and it reflects off this. But that ah, works alright. You can give you some light and you can actually see what you're doing. So, actually, it worked out a okay. So, it's a win in my book. Alrighty, well, we got your blow snow right back in the corner there. We got the mow lawner back out here. And I'm gonna just kind of tidy stuff up here and sweep this floor out a little bit. And it's almost lunchtime now anyway, so I think what I'll go do, I'll go end this up for you guys, help you get a laugh out of it. And then I'll probably go diddle around the W4 after lunch for a bit. And we might shoot a little more paint in that front axle and get kind of touched up a bit. And then back to work Monday. So until next time, please comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks for watching.